Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. Hello it doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions match. utopian, the sun is high in the sky. It's a truly beautiful afternoon and the crowd reflect that. Their faces hopeful, their smiles beaming, levels of excitement and expectation are soaring and you get the feeling that this could be a very special occasion indeed. And so a wonderful view of this most hallowed turf. A truly special feeling, no matter who is playing at Wembley. Wembley Stadium, connected by EE. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. He's played him through. Oh, that's such a good run. More of that, please. Great leap! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, this is simple. The supply is to be admired. The defending is to be admonished. Portugal with the corner. They're first. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Bernardo Silva. He's managed to get it all wrong. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. It's their second corner of the game. Slovenia can counter promptly here. So, Jim, tell me this. Who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Jan Oblak. He's not someone you often see pulling off spectacular saves but that's about the highest compliment you can give a goalkeeper because it speaks to his positioning and his organizational abilities he's just about the best there is when it comes to to claiming crosses and high balls into the box too and is just the kind of presence that spreads a, a composure and a confidence Cristiano The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. The goal scorer for Portugal after 13 minutes is number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Portugal gain their reward with an early goal. That's a throw. And he's had it nicked away. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. <laughs> Portugal making the ideal... Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Ronaldo with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. 1-0 the score. Vitinha. Now it's Rafael Leao. And Mendes. And it's Pepe. Nuno Mendes. Oh, such a clever touch. Rafael's horrific header. Denied by an instinctive save. Cristiano Ronaldo really must be thinking what he has to do to score there. Matches Nunes. And it's Cancelo. Now it's Bernardo Silva. Fire deep towards the back post. Nuno Mendes. Pepe. Here's Petinha. And it's Cancelo. 
to Cancelo. Bernardo Silva. Vitinha. Ball played for Matius Nunez. Vitinha. This is what good chemistry is all about. Oh, that's wonderful alertness. Cristiano Ronaldo and Bernardo Silva! Oh no, it's an own goal! Oh, it's an unusual turn of events and it was an honest attempt to help out and I suppose it can happen to anyone. Fortuitous as it may have been, they all count one. Bruno Fernandes carries the ball down the right. And it's Cancelo. <laughs> Lovely bit of skill. Half time coming up, and little doubt as to which of the two sides is the happier. Matches Nunez. Got a shot away! He's done very well to get to that. Really anticipated that well, didn't he? That a foul? Yes, the referee's given it. Could have been dangerous, but it came to nothing. Bruno Fernandes. And it's Cancelo. Here's Bettina. Two added minutes. Now it's Rafael Leal. Oh, it's a sweet ball, that. Has a go! That's a nicely weighted pass. Chance to shoot now. Shot a goal! They are rampant! again in double quick time no space no problem you just cannot stop him Cristiano Ronaldo demonstrated great strength there I mean he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away and I think it's just top top play And the whistle goes for half-time. Well, the contrast in fortunes here could not be much more stark. All smiles on one side, their qualities have shone through. But look across the other way, and Please there is nothing short of absolute deflation. Peter, do I really need to say Everyone anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Portugal have established themselves in a position of absolute supremacy. An action-packed 45 minutes, and they have raced into a three-goal lead. That gets things going for the second half. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. And he was quick to react. Vitinha. Bruno Mendes. And it's Pepe. Ruben Diaz. And it's Cancelo. Looking for options for movement. In by Cancelo. He's got tall. Arrived on cue, but fluffed his line. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Mendes. And it's played forward in towards the back stick.
Well, it's still early in the second half, but this does look like a job already done. He's found a way through. He's under a lot of pressure there. And he has been fouled there. Jao Cancelo. Cristiano Ronaldo being hunted in packs. Yeah, as you'd expect, Peter, that defence ought to know when to step up or drop off. And they finally made a decision to get tighter. The attendance for this match was 98,000. 60 minutes played. Stood up well to him there. It's a really well-measured ball. And it's Cancelo. Threads one in. It's a promising position. Bruno Fernandes with the delivery. Defending of the desperate variety. In one spot to meet it. They want to be quick to it. And the follow-up. And the keeper threw out a limb. Substitution for Portugal. Number so, 10. third corner of the game. Bernardo Silva. Number 17. Rafaele. Up for a header. In for the pieces! And that is doing no harm. His radar picked up on that very quickly, and he was first to react. The pressing's intense, and it's paid off. There's the hit! Another chance! Pedro Neto! No contest, it is a landslide. Some heroic goalkeeping, but even that couldn't save them this time. Well, that's not the best attempt by the keeper, and he's just paid the ultimate price, hasn't he? It's become a case of men against boys. Portugal still have the cards to affect this game. Now that's been intercepted. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. Oh, that's well spotted. That's a throw. Substitution for Portugal. Number eight, Bruno Fernandes. Number 23. What pass isn't the best? The field, number 11, João Felix. Number six. Substitutions taking place. Portugal will have one further opportunity to make a substitution after this, their latest change. Keeper always had the measure of that. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Substitution in progress. So their fourth corner of the game. And that has been knocked clear. And now they can spring out of defence. It's out of play, and it is a goal kick. Slovenia making consecutive changes here. Substitution. So, time for a potential game-changer. Yeah, I think it's time for some brave decision-making. Clears it out of harm's way. Did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Ruben Diaz and João Palinha. Oh, it's great work in terms of both purpose and intensity. Ruben Diaz. And it's Cancelo. João Felix. 
Cristiano Ronaldo. Kurtic. Still no way through. The defending here is resolute. Pedro Neto. Pedro Neto! And another time! Matius Nunes. Four added minutes. To a minimum of four minutes additional time. Played out towards the right wing. Driving forward. He's a sharp little ball here. And the shot! It's in! And it is becoming almost too painful to watch. Where to next? Yeah, it has become ugly for one, but the other is still delivering beauty. And there was his third, and boy, he looks for business, doesn't he just? Well, you had to fancy him, Peter. He seems to be growing in stature with every goal. Portugal totally rampant here. A beautifully... Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Well, that was a shimmering, sizzling, scintillating game. The key characters glittered throughout and did what they did when required so to do. There could be only one outcome. Cristiano Ronaldo reflecting on a stellar performance and now taking home a permanent reminder for his mantelpiece. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? I thought it lived up to its billing, Peter. Very competitive, open and entertaining. And a little debating room as to whether the outcome was fair. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.